Was it made in 1906? I don't know. But it's called 1906 Reserve Special. This comes from Spain and is a Hell's Bock in style. I don't know if I've had a Hell's Bock before. I've had a Hell's and I've had a Bock, but never a Hell's Bock. This is the first for me. It's a 330. And as we can see there, 6.5% uh, from Spain. Not sure if this is a craft beer or whether this is a legit uh you know a legit beer like san miguel sort of made from a real brewery so hay fevers is causing havoc today uh my nose is twinging like a bitch try not to sneeze you can see my eyes are starting to go like red already man what a way to start the review of hay fever um yeah i don't know if this is a craft beer or whether it's generally a legit beer like san miguel from a proper brewery i've got a feeling judging my label it's a craft beer can't read spanish um i may have to get a translator to translate which i probably will do at some point but there it is anyway quite a cool looking bottle so let's crack this open extremely carbonated Extremely carbonated. 1906 there, black with red writing. It also says Reserva Special. Reserva Special. Mr. Forty, Mr. Forty. Right, here we go. Wow, okay. That's an interesting colour, and I think I know why it's like that because they've they've gone for the colour of a bock, but then looking at the style and the way that you know this is somewhat clear, but with great carbonation. I think that's where the hells comes in. So I've got to finish in a bit clean, uh, refreshing beer with plenty of flavour. But again, I've never had this. I don't know anything about this beer at all. So I'm just going straight in the deep end, sink or swim, as they say. And I'm going to probably sink, maybe. Who knows? Um, right. Colour is of a an in-between colour of a gold uh, and a copper. It's an odd one. You get it in certain light here, it looks copper. I get it right in the light near the window, and it's like a lightish copper, I guess, with hints of red in it. The head, small, minimal. But it's there. Carbonation's okay. Grainy. Cereal. And I've smelled that before and I'm not sure what that smell is. I want to say a hop maybe or even a... Uh, I don't know. Maybe even a malt. There's something there that's familiar but I can't put my finger on it. It's a smell that I've smelled quite a lot and I don't know what it is uh, aromas are okay nothing special but let's hope the taste is special so cheers everyone man I'm good I'm good that was spot on I was spot on Light in the body, just like a Hells, as in the style. Um, often Germany are renowned for Hells and Box as well. Uh, Hells being more of a summer drink, Bock being a winter drink. This has both, and I love this. Straight away, the, the flavour's there, and it's long lasting, I can tell you. This is going to be one of my new favourites. It's, that's, it's just right in between. You've got a light body, which comes from the hells. The flavour, not quite of a bock. The flavour's very perfumey. But the perfumey sort of taste almost develops into aroma. So you get a aromad palette of perfume. 
that's a bit florally, a little bit biscuity, a bit malty. I would say a little bit smoky. There's, there's a real combination there. I can taste caramel. I can taste hop. Plenty of hop. Reasonable amount of caramel. The body of the beer is exceptionally light. Um, I don't taste the carbonation. I'm not going to lie, I don't taste the carbonation at all. Very easy, mellow. The flavours are mellow, but they're strong at the same time. It gives the impression of a first timer of, okay, yeah, we're just mellow. Bang, there's a flavour. And it, it's beautiful. It works really well. The flavours are combined. You've got strong flavours at that in places, especially on the aftertaste. And the aftertaste delivers very well because it hangs around. My mouth is just constantly tasting like a smoky caramel. It's it's really beautiful. I, this is this is surprised me. It's yeah, it's just I'm gonna shut up now. no English version so what I know is there's hops and there's water there's malt and maize right so I've got water malt maize hop that's it so it may be the maize that I'm tasting and I get maize is a type of corn so it's like that sort of Taste. I don't know what it I had to do, put it in into words, but yeah, it's there. It's there. What a great beer! I will score 1906. Uh, what was it now? A special something? A Spania Reserve. <clears throat> 1906 Reserve. A special. La Minerva. I will score that. A nine out of ten. Well done, Spain. Keep going. Keep up the good work. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Easy way to subscribe. See that little icon down there in that corner that's me click on that and you'll be subscribed till next time